ocean. Ocean by Greenland. Roblox. Have you ever gone to the ocean? Yeah, yeah, I say it's pretty fun. I go all the time. And uh, that's great. Have you ever gone to the ocean and there was waste or pollution that's ruined your fun? Oh my god. We went last year with Simon Salazar and we had to drag him out like a fish. He got tangled in fishing line and we couldn't get him out. The waste is horrible. We need to fix this. Thank you for your input. What is your name? Uh, Mr. O'Donnell. All right, Mr. O'Donnell, and what do you teach in Harry Hudson? Uh, right now I'm teaching STEAM, um, but I also have taught biology and environmental science. All right, well, that's perfect for our questions today. First question, do you enjoy the beach? Love the beach, yeah. Yeah, we have some history of you surfing and all that good stuff. Uh -huh. And uh, has there been any time where you've been at the beach and you were in the ocean and you saw waste or pollution? All the time. Yeah, it's, uh, I've seen plastic bla bags floating, balloons, um, I mean, there are times that I've, I've seen, you know, needles wash up on the beach, um, you name it, I've probably seen it wash up. Yeah. Okay. Now, as the science teacher you are with steam and environmental mm -hmm. biology and all that, do you have any solutions for what we could do about the waste problem? Um... So there's, there's a few solutions that are currently being done. Um, one guy, he, uh, I think he was probably 18 years old when he came up with the idea. He just decided to make a giant net, to put it out mm. in the ocean, and um, it captures whatever it comes across. You put it in areas where you know, certain currents run and um, areas of really high pollution. So that's an option. Right. But realistically, no. We can't really do anything unless we just stop using, you know, the, the plastics and whatever else ends up in the ocean as pollution in the first place. Right. Well, thank you very much for your time. With what Mr. O'Donnell said, do you think that we could solve the pollution problem on our planet before it's too late? 